right, folks, cool project for you today. We are restoring restoration of the, <laughs> basically abandoned at this point. We're at the new house, by the way. New house, in case you guys haven't seen it, you haven't seen it on this channel, um, you can see it on my, my main. But we have we built this truck about a year and a half ago. This thing's freaking sick, but it's been sitting here. We actually used it as like a tripod for a time lapse for the longest time, um, and it's been abandoned. And it's sitting here, but we figured it's the perfect vehicle to take out to the missile silo for a bug out vehicle that we can jump on. And if we're under attack, we can drive around. We literally outfitted this thing for uh, like an apocalypse, essentially. So wabam, that is the mini truck. And we are going to be rescuing it. It doesn't start. It hasn't ran for about a year and a half. And uh, was the key on? No, yeah. oh, it definitely ain't going to start then. Um, but we're the fuel's still have been in here for a year and a half. So we're probably have to new fuel new battery maybe clean the sparks or, or add some sparks um but to give you a tour i mean we we did custom paint is it's you drive on the right side we got fishing rod holders purex lights we got this seat right here so it's like you, you know you need to ride around you can have two people sitting here shooting we want to use it because doomsday is coming and we need to get prepped at the missile silo these um, guys go flat so we can have like a yes. flat bed. Yeah, they go all the way down. You've got your hitch receiver on here so you can tow stuff. And like I said, the seats, the pew mounts. I mean, we got off-road tires. It's four-wheel drive. It's a uh, it's a little high-jet Japanese truck. And uh, yeah, isn't it crazy? It's it's manual. Oh, that mice been in here, huh? Rip. The old right-handed drive. Yeah, we... Oh yeah, there ain't. She's dead. There ain't there ain't nothing to that. So we got to get her. We got to get her up. How many? More? How many, how many people we get? I don't know. The, the power guys are doing power things, so that we're probably in their way. But um, we'll get this out of here. Don't worry. Uh, so like I said, this thing's been sitting here forever. We need to get it out of here, cleaned up, ready to go. Make sure the tires are good. Make sure all of the uh, all this stuff works on this sucker. Because we like so we're gonna take it to the silo and we'll be filming a video on the main channel soon, prepping for doomsday. You got Putin out there, you know, messing around, hitting the nuke button and whatnot. And so we need to. Uh, we need to make sure we're ready, and we need a mode of transportation that's already out there. Something that if, again, somebody wants to come attack our fort, that we can get mobile and get, you know, the high ground on them or whatever it might be. And this is like the perfect vehicle because we literally designed it for that. Plus, we can leave it just sit out there because, well, it's already sitting out here instead of putting a, like a new side by side. So it does not start. So we did bring the tilt trailer with a winch. That winch does not work. So we brought a, an electric come along, and we got a... Speaking of the power, guys, hopefully the power's not, hopefully it's not cut because we need the power to try to get this thing winched up, strapped up. Like I said, we'll take it, then we'll take it to the house, tear the whole thing apart, and by the end of today, hopefully, fingers crossed, we've got the mini truck up and running and ripping, and we're gonna take it to the missile silo. Stay tuned. Giddy up, partner. That should get it all the way up, don't you think? Yeah. Enough to then drop it, and then we can like roll it forward. Yeah. Luckily, that thing's not very big. Yeah. That looks proof. You like that? Oh, there it goes. Oh, We're good. Guys. All right. I can do that. Start, you know, start jacking up the, give me the old jack. What's this rated for? No idea. This thing's Japanese too. Really? Mm -hmm. uh, it'd be alright. It's just pushing. It's not just like lifting it. Yeah. When the spring's pressed, is that on? Unlo pull unlocked. Back towards you. Uh, no, push it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. But the spring should be compressed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. What do we got dang on here? Yeah, one of these. Besides, besides that little snackle tooth thing. You don't feel good about him? I mean, I mean, Where it's not bad, it's just not. Center. Somebody might have to get in and steer. steer. I think we're good. All right, Benji, you're steering. There it is. Benji, you steering or what? I don't care. So it's just going to pull it way that way. I'm trying to. Yeah, I guess just steer it, huh? How's, How's that going? going? It's coming. Is it doing it? It's like that much. That one looks like it's locked still. There's a. Oh. <laughs> I know too. 
This guy. This guy. He's got the First other one. Big, big, big other First side lock guy. All right. Think she'll go in neutral? I should get in just in case she starts ripping. <laughs> really? She's in neutral. There it is. Is he getting her figured out? First time you sent a trailer or what? Yeah, I thought there was only one. I didn't know there was two. Now we're good. Pump it up. That'll help. Oh yeah, it's easier when it's unlocked. Yeah, really. <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to help. They should just open it up and see if all three of us can stand on that side. <laughs> it might. It might. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <sighs> you got it. That'll work. Take the double action pump. That thing doesn't work. Yeah, she's in neutral. He breaks off. You just gotta crank that wheel to me. Yeah. We'll see what happens. Oh god, there we go. now we're getting tight. Alright. Let's go! Straighten her out! There you go. I have to give her the old push. You're good, just straight at me, you're good. Alright, hold it. Now what? <laughs> uh, we gotta bring it all back. This winch got yanked, so that's our problem here. or no, just straight up. What if we put the winch rope on here and put the cord back and put it on the trailer to the top of the wall? One time, what, what are you saying? Clip the cable into that hook and okay. then we'll just run this back and clip it on so that this is half as long. How do you? Keep extending that thing. Just keep going. I'm just going to clip it on. Take two. I'm gonna drop this. There it is. Yeehaw, brother. Oh, nice. That's how that comes out. Perfect. You want her forward. She's gonna roll forward. Yeah, alright, hang on. Hook's pretty strong. I like that. It's a nice hook. 
All right, unplug this. It's very rare when stuff works out how we plan it. Yeah, how'd heads, that work? Right? <laughs> How's that going? You didn't hip it or anything? It's weird. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, she's dead. She's not horny? No, we're at. Now let's go. Alright. This thing works pretty good. Alright, hang on, let me get this. Alright, see if it'll roll. No? I gotta give her a push. She was at first. You get your foot off the brake? Yeah. Really? Turn towards me a little bit. These tires flat or what? Nah, it's going just barely. Push the clutch in, see what happens. Far left. Okay, okay the brakes. That was there. <laughs> yeah. I don't think we were in neutral the whole time. Something. I should have just had you put the clutch in. That's probably good for it, huh? Dragging it like that? Yeah, it helps. Alright. Uh, pull the e-brake. Okay. Alright, we're good. Alright, we're gonna strap her down. Take her back to the shop. See if we can get the old camel mini truck rocking and rolling. Stay tuned. Shoo! We made it! Alrighty. So, we got a new battery. This battery is not the same as this one. We actually don't even know if this battery is bad, necessarily. It's just, it's dead, right? So, um... We're gonna yank the battery out anyway, so that way we can go take it in and charge it. So we gotta get this off here. Um, <clears throat> try to connect this battery to this, which they don't have the same terminals or anything. Nothing is even the same. So the battery's first. Then we also got some fuel treatment seafoam. This stuff, which is supposed to help with cleaning the jet, the fuel injectors, the carbs, um, reduce engine wear, add to oil, clean harmful, yeah. So um, basically this thing sat for a while and then we'll put fresh fresh fuel in it um, so that way it's fresh fuel and we get some seafoam treatment mix it all around with a fresh battery fingers crossed we also we're going to get spark plugs um just to be safe and it's like under it's like under this like there's no like way to get to the engine that's easy so i really hope that works and we don't have to actually do anything with the spark plugs i mean we have cleaner too so we always clean them but obviously we want we don't want to make it any more work than we have to so we're going to start with that i mean it may just fire right up i have no idea but we're going to start with getting the battery swapped throwing the other one on a charger or a tester i should say see if that battery is good i mean because like before this battery worked fine but we didn't want to come back here and then need a new battery because it's like an hour to go get new battery so we're just like all right let's just get this one even though this one's like a 200 and some dollars Maybe we'll take it back if we can, if we don't need this, if we can just charge this guy. We're not really sure, but I mean, the way this whole thing's rigged up, there, there's a whole lot going on under there. It's not just like the normal two terminal. They got two terminals connected to a couple little ring things, and I don't know what powers do what, but um, yeah. I mean, this thing sat, the mice were in it. It could, it could just not do anything. There's a chance it'll work, and if it does, like I said, you guys will see it first here. I'd like to take this back though. That's two hundred some bucks. I probably won't. Yeah, that thing's a little necessary. So the guy told us in there. He's like, we showed him this one. He was like, "Oh yeah, I ain't gonna do nothing in there." And he was like, "This one sucks, but this one's supposed to be." Better. I I don't know like if that is that battery design. Was that just small battery? Like that battery? I can't remember if we put a new battery in so it. What do you say? Well, or if it came? The, he said it was like a old cranking amps on this. Yeah, one. it's just it's like trash. Nothing, and this one's almost nothing but better than that one. So I'm gonna go ahead and pull the battery off, put it on a tester, and try to charge it back up. And maybe we just use this just to get it jumped, essentially. Um, and that way we can just swap the batteries back once this thing's juiced up. So let's get her up and running. Stay tuned. All right. If I was this nut, what size would I be? Hey, first go. try. Let's go. It's going to be a good day. All right. Getting this sucker taken off here. You got it. There you go. going to be smart. Yeah. Hey. All right, let's take this off. So this is just what holds the battery in there. I'm not. I couldn't remember. Do you remember if we got a new battery or was it if this was original? I feel like I you got know. a new one. And so it doesn't look sure. new, but it also no. isn't new. You know, it sat in the sun for. Yeah. How freaking good lord! That. Okay, done. done. Now I gotta just loosen that to get it off. Yep. You want to get a charger tester out and see what happens? Oh, I'm getting it. We're good. Yep. Yep. Oh, 
what the hell are these? I think you can just slip past that, can't you? Or not? Yeah. I think that's originally probably how they kept it in there, but... There it is. Alright. Battery's it's out. Battery. You don't think so? Alright, battery's out. You really old test. Let's see if she reads any. Analyzing. Let's see what it, we'll see what it says here. Dead. Charging. Charging. It should say charging. And then a percent. Volt. Charging. It should say charging twelve volt and then the percent that it's on. Big charging guy. It might be toast. I don't know. That's what it did when we put that one other interstate one on there. It was and it was bad. It didn't say twelve volt in the percentage. It just said charging. What if we put it on the good one? See that makes a difference. You grab that guy. Put it on the good battery. Then we'll see what percentage this is at. Really? Really? Is this thing broken now or what? It didn't. Oh, oh, you unplugged it. I say it didn't. It didn't like. Um, when we disconnected, it didn't say, hey, like, oh, you just disconnected it, you know what I mean? There yeah, so, let's, so let's see. That's analyzing again. I mean, this better say what it's charging here. 12 yeah. volt, 95%. So this one's most likely toast. I would say. Probs. We'll just toss it on for now. Yeah. And then we got to figure out how to connect this. So the difference between these two, by the way, this one has small nipples, and this one has really wide nipples. So we it's brought... W nipple um, things. Hopefully you can see that. Nipple um, reducers. They, they clamp like that. Yeah. Should work. So we just need to kind of get all that undone. Yeah. Uh, I got a fat. I got a fat one just in case you get horny. Really? Mm-hmm. That one work? Yeah. You need to keep all these straight. Yeah. Okay. There's the old guy. He's little. Does not fit. Upgrade that. We're going bigger. How's that going, Andrew? No clue. No worries. It used that. to sit on the workbench, but. I Gosh dang it, dude. Then should we just take these off and put bigger ones on there? So freaking close. Oh, I think I can thread can it. Thread it? Oh, yeah. No, you definitely can. You got one. All right, we got one. We got one. See, we're doing something. Who's calling me now? Really? Big call guy. Calls me the big business guy. It's him. Big meeting guy. All righty, folks. Well, we're getting... Yeah. yeah. We got to get a re, uh, redone up. Hopefully this battery works because we're literally redoing all the wiring for this battery to where if we get a brand new one of these, then we got to... Kind of a pain in the butt. Huh? Yeah, I'm having fun. It's always something, you it's know. Always something. It's always, it's it always went something. Too easy. Yeah, it went on the trailer too easy. Yeah, so uh, he's gonna just we we'll basically strip it and put all the fittings on it. Banjo and I are gonna try to get this thing sea foamed. You ever use this stuff? Nah, I mean I know what it is, but I. Yeah. What, what is she doing? Fetch. Does she does she see a turkey? Lucy. Millie's over there too. Lucy, are they eating a turkey? You think? Hey, don't eat the turkeys. Okay. Um, so this stuff is supposed to help. I know this gas tank leaks. Remember that? When we take it on the hills. Yeah. So how do you how do you put it in? Does it say a certain when 25 a gallons? greater cleaning concentration is needed? Yes. Okay. Yeah, that's Use our... two or more ounces per gallon. Well, how many gallons are in there? Do we we don't know that, huh? Twenty. Zero. Fifteen. No, definitely not twenty. Probably like 11. I'd, I'd say that's about an 11 one, you know? Yeah, you can't really tell. That ain't gonna tell you. ain't gonna tell you nothing. I mean, I don't know if it's full, if it's... It sounds kind of empty. Yeah, it sounds empty to me. I hope it is. Yeah. I wonder if you just ran it out of gas, that's why I wouldn't start. No, it, it, it was more than that, but... Um, okay, so how many how many ounces per gallon? Let's see. Use two or more ounces per gallon. So so one one thing we could do is fill it up with fuel. Yep. And then see how much fuel we get put in there, maybe? Yeah. All right, so let's get some fresh, no ethanol, all right? We're getting premium fuel put into this bad boy. 
pick one, anyone. There it is. All right, we'll see if it holds. If it holds this five, I mean, that fuel tank might only be like seven, eight gallons. It's kind of tough to say, honestly. It's 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 old and it's it's small. All right, so let's fill that fill that thing up and see if it takes all five gallons, and then we can at least add five gallons worth of treatment. I don't know. It could be could be better than nothing. So we'll we'll let you know what she what she holds. All right. Well, she took all of about six gallons. So I still don't really know what that means, but we can at least safely add 12 ounces. And how much is it? 16. Okay. How's it? Pull this thing out, maybe. Oh, I see. It's like getting milk carton. Oh, there it is. You just dump her in. I didn't really factor. I didn't really leave. <laughs> like I filled it to the brim. <laughs> So it doesn't really have anywhere to go, but we're gonna top her off. Oh yeah. Oh, she's sucking. Really? Oh yeah, she sucked it down nice. You hear sucking? Just give the old Glock. Really? That was she... not needed. Yeah, it was going. Look how full she is. If she don't run now, I don't know when she will. Is that bad? Just dripping fuel everywhere. Yeah. Hey, what First the? First time putting the cap on I never, put, I never put fuel in the before here. She was sucking, now she's spitting. Wow. Yeah. That was not called for. Really? Okay. I mean, she is full of fuel. So hopefully we don't ever have to drain it. And we got... Pretty much all of that in there. I would assume there's at least. That would be eight gallons, and I put six in, so there's probably two in there. I think we'll be all right. So that's done. I mean, that's all we really have besides, like I said, spark plugs, but right now we're still trying to hook up the battery, so spark plugs just doesn't seem feasible right now. But let's go see how Jake's doing. How's this going? About as good as it could be. <laughs> really? <laughs> this is some this is some garage-level mechanic stuff here. Well, getting it torched up, I guess. Yeah. I know, I definitely, I can go look for a heat gun. I probably got one somewhere, but. Need one. You, need, you need one, you think? Yeah, it would help. Okay, yeah. all right, we'll go, we'll go look for a heat gun. We're done. You're done, oh, oh, you just gotta, oh, really? I'm just doing that, and the terminals are all new. And everything should be ready to roll. If this don't start, we're gonna be, we're gonna be out of luck. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <sighs> what do you think? I don't know, <laughs> let's give her the test. Well, we got a full battery, I mean, She's, She's on there. Not, not New fuel and sea foam. You ready for the old test? The, th the fact that the battery was bad, like bad, bad, meaning it's not working at all, tells me we have a chance. And I think there wasn't much gas in there. Which it could have made, could have not been good. We got fresh, good fresh premium with sea foam. You gonna jump in there and give her hell or what? Sure. Just put your clutch in, cause I don't know where the hell what you're in right now. Okay. Slam the clutch, and give her the old twist. I guess. The Electrical questions here. Oh, okay. Wipers? <laughs> Give her a little gas. Give a little ass. Go, try one, one more time. time. <laughs> sparks, probably. We're probably not getting spark. Hey, battery. Battery works, that's, though. That's works. Should we pop that panel out of the bed and see if we can clean the spark plugs off? We're going to have to. Give her one more try. One more try. She's neutral, too. He's got the clutch. Oh, I got the clutch. Oh, you good. Oh. Ooh, she tried. Lay off the gas. Lay off it. Yeah. Oh! Go! No way! Oh, we got to take her for a rip now. Get, it, these, get the straps undone, boys. Oh, clutch in. Oh, oh, so you're not, so you're not in neutral, then, probably. Not in neutral. All right, here. Yeah, you, yeah, you want to YouTube it. I can jump. Here, I'll jump. I'll see what's going on. Let's go. Yeah. All right, we can start unstrapping it. We're gonna take okay. beefcake. We're gonna whip some shop. shitties in this sucker. <laughs> Fright break it. I'll see. Oh no, we were in third. Oh, that helps. Right away. She sounds new. Let's go, beefcake auto mechanics. She changes one battery. <laughs> Let's go. New fuel. All right, yes. we're gonna unstrap her. We're gonna give her a rip. This thing has not been driven for, like I said, almost two years. I'm excited. All right, boys. Would you try 
drive off, is it gonna wanna lift? With it might. The tires are off. Yup. Yup. I can still go though. It'll be alright. No, it's fine. Oh. Is it high centered? Oh yeah, you're touching the old transmission right now. Frank, Banjo, we might need to pump it up. You want me to pump? Tighten pump the little, Banjo, start pumping me. Tighten the keeper thing and then start pumping. Okay. Close. Uh, a little bit right fast. It's a good thought. <laughs> yeah, you're good. The old front end Except it's locked, yeah. Go keep pumping. I'll have to let him, because otherwise it'll take off the front bumper. This thing doesn't have much of a front bumper. Gun it? <laughs> I think so. Alright, you're good. Hey! Hop on in! Pick <laughs> them up! What's in four, four wheel? We ain't going nowhere. Yeah, I had four wheel drive put in the sucker too. Really? There it is. There it is. <laughs> Millie! <laughs> Millie! Oh, I love this thing. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> the horn doesn't work! What the hell? Let's see, see if reverse works. Really? So you can back it up, Terry. I think it beeps, too. Maybe not. No, it doesn't beep. I thought it beeped. Oh, well, the horn's probably out. It used to go beep! Beep. Oh, that's the that's the old tires rubbing. We put we put the <laughs> tall ones we put the tall ones on. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Now we're cooking. Let's go. This thing's a beast. This thing's gonna be so cool with the middle. This thing's a beast. Beep, 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 beep. Where'd, that... Where'd he go? Banjo? Banjo! Banjo! Yeah. Where you at? Right here. Huh? Where, where are you? Taking a shit? Where were you? Where? What were you doing? I'm taking a piss. No, oh, he's taking a piss. That's what I thought. You gonna hop in or? I'll drive. I'll wire back here. You think so? Yeah. Should we go to the racetrack? Sure. <laughs> I'm still alive. Let me on your gut. Go We're for good. it. Then kill it. Kept her alive. Hopefully the brakes work. Yeah. Yeah, we didn't test those. Oh god. Yeah. That sounds good. It's getting exhausted. Yeah. For sure. Just a minor one. It's all right. Oh God, where are we going? Dude, I do not want to go up this hill in this thing. Oh, good Lord. Oh, he's definitely stalling us out. He didn't quite make it. Hang on. Hang on, I'll back it up a little bit. I think I might have actually had her in third. You like this thing? Yeah, this thing's cool. <laughs> I also, like the exhaust leak. You, you like the safari me. seats? Oh, yeah. There it is. Yeah, buddy. Let's wait till this next hill. hill. Yeah, this hill. Oh, barely. Hit it. Yeah. Hit the ramp. Really? Really? Hitting the ramp. Oh, God. Oh, shit. He scared the shit out of me. I thought he was doing it. I was like, I'm dead for sure. There it is. The old bump. Why? Why? Shoo! We made it to the racetrack. There's only one thing to do, and that's race.
<laughs> How's that going, Banjo? Dude, sucker works. That's, that's an experience back there. You whipping shitties or no? <laughs> that was as shitty as it gets. That's as shitty as it gets. This thing, got, this thing Really? Oh, Lucy, get the hell. That's what I do too. Sucker's got like half a horsepower for Lucky <laughs> yeah. on a good day. See, Jake, this is what we're talking about. Look right here. That's that's good. You know, windshield wipe? That's the old windshield. It's a little low. Yeah, it might be all right. Oh, this thing's sick. We got the pew holders, okay, here, fishing holders. This thing's. Anyone else? Exhausting. Like, they have lung cancer? Yeah, higher than shit. No, I'm, I definitely have lung cancer now. <laughs> Banjo, you've driven this or no, oh, Banjo? Yeah, I've driven this thing before. I was so bumpy, it said. Record an outdoor cycle. You were cycling. Yeah. You haven't driven it though, have you? No, Take me no, all right, all right. Let's. Uh, I guess you can just drive it right here. Okay. Give her, give her a rip. Where did you come from? Do, you got it. Any tricks to train nah, it? Nah, you got it. Just figure it out. I like how the tires are just right under they're, you. They're just, they're there. Not when he goes. Oh, that's the old. Yeah. yeah. That's the old ghost. That's, the get, that's the get up and go. What's she in? Neutral. She's in neutral. Okay. Lucy, Lucy, come here. Come here, Lucy. Lucy. Come here, buddy. Your e-brake on. Yes. Okay, I probably should fix that first. <laughs> that helps. Yeah. There it is. Yeah, let's make, yeah, make sure she's all the way in one. Because I was in three earlier, and that didn't get you very far oh, very quick. Good. Yeah, that's why we stalled on the hill. Oh, yeah. oh Come here, Lucy. Get, the, get over here. Yeah! Hey. Yeah, he's the ramp. Sheesh. Yeah, without people in the back, it's nice. Yeah. Uh, yeah, people. What, did it feel like you were gonna fall over at all? Oh, it or? felt like we were gonna tip every three seconds. Really? Oh, he's ripping. He's ripping. Oh my God. I think he has to only he only drive this now. Lucy, hey, come here. The new, new daily? Very, she doesn't get very shitty. I mean, no. Is this the new daily or not? I think so. I like it. Let's take it to the silo. I think we got to. Benji, you got to rip it? What does that do? That, that's the old radio station. Oh, get the old. Yeah, she, now you're up. This is, like. this, is re, this is ready for the apocalypse. This is ready for doomsday. Well, we got her fixed up and ready to go. It wasn't as complicated as I thought. Um, I really did think we were going to like, tear apart the engine and do stuff, which is why we made this video. But I hope you guys enjoyed it regardless. It was a good time. I'm glad to have her back after a year and a half of not doing anything. It's good to have this investment back. And then probably go leave it at another property and do nothing with it. But we'll see. Maybe we'll do something. We need a, like I said, we need a vehicle, something that's reliable. This thing's, this thing's older than you, Banjo. This thing's like a ninety. This thing's older than you. It's like a ninety-five or something. Uh, so yeah, she's, older she's old reliable. Yeah. yeah. So that's what you need. You need old. You don't need them Rangers. Now you need one of these bad boys. These yeah. suckers will get you where you need to be. Not fast, but it'll get you where you need to be. So hope you guys enjoyed today's video. We, like said, we got her fixed up. If there's any other modifications we should do to this thing, let us know. I can't really think of anything. Um, like I said, it's, it's pretty much ready for World War III, the apocalypse, nuclear attack, and we're going to be taking it to the missile silo on the main channel. The main channel you're going to see, we're going to do a whole video where we prep for this nuke war that's happening between Putin and, I don't know who's, who Putin's mad at, but he's mad about something. So anyways, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Remember, subscribe if you have not already. Link down in the description down below to go to the other channel too, if you guys don't know what that is. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. We'll catch you in peace.